Tonight, Noor Salman leaving the courthouse without a word. It's a great day for Ms. Salman. Her attorneys reacting to the not guilty verdicts. I think she was overwhelmed. I think we were all overwhelmed. But outside the Pulse nightclub where Salman's husband, Omar Mateen, launched his massacre, killing 49 people, outrage from victims' families. She knew that her husband was doing what he was doing and shame on her. I am in disbelief. I just feel like we've been slapped in the face. During the trial, prosecutors said this video showed Mateen about to attack Disney Springs, but was scared off by the presence of police. And they alleged Salma knew her husband's plans, that she'd been on an alleged scouting mission at the same Disney location, that she'd joined him when he shopped for ammunition. At the center of their case, her statement, an FBI agent saying she admitted her husband was preparing for jihad. Salma herself writing, I'm sorry for what happened. I wish I'd go back and tell his family and the police what he was going to do. We really did pursue the truth. Defense attorneys charged that statement was coerced, that she has a low IQ, her uncle, Al Salman. I said that's day one, that she is innocent. Her family saying she too is a victim betrayed by her now dead husband. Tonight, expected to head back to California to reunite with her young son. Kerry Sanders, NBC News, Miami. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.